Patrick Mahomes leads the league with 26 touchdown passes through eight games. Remarkable considering the last time a Browns quarterback had more than that in a season was all the way back in 2007 when Derek Anderson threw for 29 touchdowns. Now the Chiefs are in Cleveland this weekend and that's where Tom Palacero is this morning. Hey Tom, how's Cleveland treating you today? Well, the rain is pouring down, and I'm hoping by 7 a.m. tomorrow when I'm on with you guys, that will have stopped. Listen, the numbers are off the charts, Colleen, for the Chiefs offense and Patrick Mahomes, who certainly would have his teammates' MVP vote at this stage. But running back Kareem Hunt told me, it feels like we're just going out there and playing football. Then at the end of the day, we look at the numbers and say, I didn't know that we were going to have that many yards. Teammates uh, talk a lot about Mahomes' leadership and poise in just his second NFL season. It's part of the reason that they think that he's capable of keeping this up. As Hunt told me, he is relaxed under pressure, and it's hard to coach that. Meanwhile, the Browns rebooting offensively around their young quarterback, Baker Mayfield, after the firings of Hugh Jackson and Todd Haley. Players say there's been no overhaul to their scheme, nor would they have had time to overhaul the scheme, but expect interim OC for Freddie Kitchens to simplify some things for Mayfield, help him out a little bit in terms of the route combinations. Also, don't overlook the probable return of receiver Rashard Higgins. He's listed as questionable, but told me he's good to go. That was a very reliable target for Mayfield before Higgins injured a knee a month ago, Colleen. Oh, that's good news there for Baker Mayfield. Thank you, Tommy P. Well, the Chiefs offense, top five in yards, in points, red zone, and big plays. But Mike Robb. Tell me more about Tyreek Hill. Yeah, I think the reason why they're so successful offensively is because, I mean, they have what you can't coach. Speed. Like, real <laughs> speed. That's what, you're, that's what you're born with, right? And Tyreek Hill does so much to open up other opportunities for other receivers and other backs. And obviously, I have some tape to show yeah, you, you do. exactly what I'm talking about. You look at right here, he's lined up in the backfield. Look at all the attention the defenders give to him, which creates a lane for another explosive athlete on this offense and Kareem Hunt to get in, to get in the end zone. Look at what he's doing. Look at he's high-stepping out there. He's creating, he's, he's forcing the defense to look his way and you, you you look at it again he's screaming through the middle of the defense look at how the defenders leave their linebacker one-on-one -on -one yeah. with, a, with a running back uh out of the backfield creating another explosive play again Tyreek Hill has so much speed that you, you cannot teach this this is God-given uh, ability you look at it again right here the entire defense is watching him he's sprinting down the football field the safety comes off of comes off of his spot in the middle of the field to cover Tyreek Hill which opens up a a little bit more space for the tight end down the middle of the field. I don't know how you s truly stop this Kansas City offense defensively. As we talked about earlier, pray. you can have an offense. You pray. More pray. <laughs> but uh, I look at it kind of like taxes, man. Um, you have to pay taxes, right? We all yeah. got to pay them. You just look yeah. for different ways. Look, look at you. You just look for different, <laughs> you just look for different ways to kind of not pay as much as you possibly have to. Uh, when you play in the Kansas City Chiefs, you sometimes you just have to deal with that they're going to move the football. Yep. They're going to, okay, we're going to, we may have Tyreek. He's going to get 100 mm -hmm. yards. Okay, it's about limiting their opportunities to affect the game. It's a shame we got to go to break because Mike Rob has got some. <laughs> I, got some I have so many more questions about that. Oh, boy. Wow. All right. Got to move on though. We're not it's one of those games we circle when the schedule numbers. comes out. Steelers, Ravens, from the military. two teams yeah, heading in opposite directions, landing in Baltimore <laughs> tomorrow. <laughs> Plus, Adam Thielen isn't just competing with corners these days. He's competing with history and winning the milestone he could reach. We're going to tell you what that milestone oh. is tomorrow. Uh, that's coming up next. We'll see if he can get it. And who said that? America's favorite game, the quote Adam of the Gase. week. Any from Who's that guy? Twist? Any from that guy? Adam I don't Gase know. How about from that guy? Tell me. Maybe. Is that a clue? <laughs> I don't know. I haven't even looked at it yet. I will. I need to know these